the layoff people. We had to, we were just falling apart. And that's what happened. You know, so all of a sudden, from everything rolling like like just beautiful. And I know some of you out there have been there. I know that's why you're here today. Because you know you can get back on that train. And you can make it happen. So, well, that wasn't the end of the story. Then the health things start happening, right? I take my left arm goes out on me. I can't, I can't lift it. I can't do anything with it. I had a compression in the neck, so I got to have some surgery. And it, and you know, the rehab on a nerve, if you never had them, can take up to three years. And actually, we got a lot back in the first year, but in the next two years, we got even back. And, I, and we're about ninety-eight percent. So we're recovering, and then this arm goes out. Yeah. I <laughs> say, oh, my gosh. And, you know, that's just what happens. And so we're living on savings because we really haven't had a chance to put anything together. We're reading a lot of motivational stuff. We're pumping ourselves up. But things just start falling, and you start spending all your investments, and you start spending all your savings. And I know many of you out there have been there. I know many of you. Maybe that's why you're here. You're building a business, and maybe you have tried to build it, and it's fallen off, or maybe you're just ready to do it. But all those things happen, and then one day, and this is what happens, and this is why you need to be at a boot camp like this. This is why you need to be here. This is why you need to, to come out and watch it happen. Because I was, one day I'm reading this book by Norman Vincent Peale. Who I love. And it was called Positive Imaging. And I read Positive Thinking. And you know, Peel's kind of the father of those things. And all of a sudden this light goes on and you're like, wow, really? Yeah, really. And things start to roll. And I'm now, you know what happened? Instead of just reading the books, I was taking it in here. I was really starting to internalize. I've been, I'd read most of the stuff out there, but I never really brought it in here. And when you bring in, and when you're touched by the people around you and the people you work with, things change. Your whole life changes. And all of a sudden, you turn and you're on that road back to success. And that's what can happen to you. Now, I wrote this book, and there it is, Failure Creates Success. I think that's a nice little picture of me on the back, huh? I know some of you may have this book. We got some of them here today. Failure Creates Success because that's what I want you to grab when you, when you leave here. I want you to understand there is absolutely Nothing you can't do if you believe the process. This is my process. This is kind of, I didn't invent it. Of course, it's been out there for years. But the point is, I want you to understand that if everything is going so smoothly, you have to ask yourself, am I really stretching? Am I really going after all I could go after? Am I really pushing myself as far as I can go? Have you asked yourself that question? You know, every time things don't work out and you fail, if you take that experience and you learn from it, wow, it's amazing. And the failure creates success process is really like 13 steps that, and we're not going to cover them all at the boot camp. we got a couple of days here. But I want you to understand, there's three main things that you need to do to create success in your life. And it works like this. I tell people, take a moment and think about three or four of those huge companies that are out there. Microsoft, Apple, Dell, Oracle. And think about where they started. There's people right here. Right here, just like the rest of you. And something happened. Something happened that inspired them. Something happened that changed them. And it created a vision. What was it? Wasn't it um, Bill Gates that had that vision? 
Does anybody remember what that vision was? That vision was clearly, I want to be able to put a computer in every home in America. Did he do it? <laughs> That's a great question. Did he, did he make it happen? But, but Microsoft was here. Apple was in a garage with two guys, and, and they built this thing. So if you think that you can't take your company somewhere great, forget it. You can do it, but you must have a vision. You know, people ask me, well, Manny, what's your vision? I mean, when you really think about it, what is it? What is that vision that drives you? My vision, simple. You know, I've went through some iterations, and, you know, we try to figure out, well, how do you want to do it? The vision is I want to be able to give $1 million a year away to ministry and other stuff that helps people. And that's the vision. That's what drives me. That's what gets me up every day. How does that happen? Well, we got a lot of things we got in place today that we're trying to make happen so we can get there. But what's your vision? So the first thing you need, and that's how the failure creates success process works, and that's all the stuff we're talking about today. What is it you want to do in life? What's that vision? We got people here going to talk about that today. Once you have the vision, the second thing you need is a plan. What's your plan? What's your plan out there that you're going to use to make this happen? And it's not here. I talked to so many and work with so many entrepreneurs over the years. Vision's up here. Uh, I got a vision. I got a plan. I said, where is it? It's in my head. I said, no, it's not. It doesn't exist. There's two things you got to learn about a plan. Number one, any effective plan has to be written, and number two, it has to be simple. You know, if you're a, a one or two million dollar or a half a million dollar company, and you come to me and you say, Manny, I got a business plan here, it's 78 pages and it has all these charts and all that, I say, that's wonderful. But you're not at the level where you need that kind of plan. You need a couple pages. Until you pump your sales up. And remember, that's one of the big things here today. Many of you might be doing somewhere in the six figures and you're saying, how do I crack that million? How do I crack that million? Well, that's part of what you need. You need a plan, but it needs to be simple. So when people tell you you need this elaborate business plan, some banks may require you to have something like that. But I'm telling you, that when you work with me, I will help you put together two pages that will give you everything you need to drive your business. So you need a vision. You're going to hopefully get that while you're at the conference. You need a plan. And then you need a kick in the butt. And I don't mean that terrible. I don't mean that bad. But what I'm saying is, we all think we're so good. I think I'm great. But the bottom line is, you can't do it without help. You need a coach. You need a mentor. You need partners. You need people you can trust around you. You can't do it. You And I think you understand that out there, especially that you are out there, out there that are struggling. I, I give you a, a great fact to share that, Companies who have been around a while, if you go back 10 years and you say, how much did they sell 10 years ago? You adjust that for inflation and you look at how much are they selling today? The whole thing will tell you there's not much difference. They haven't really grown. You need someone to keep you on the road. One of the things I do is keep people, the biggest thing I probably do, you know, anybody can help you build the vision and plan, but a great coach will help you get there. And that's part of what you need. So if you got a vision, you got a plan, and you got some help, you can do any of this stuff. And if you're willing to take that shot, you can make it happen. 
So, if you're here at the boot camp, great. If you're not signed up yet, come on. We want you here. This is the kind of stuff that we're going to do for you. We're going to help you get the stuff together you need to make your business roll. How to build those relationships, how to build that vision, how to put that plan together, how to get pumped up. I mean, you know, y'all know that's what I love to do, just pump you up. So look at the bottom here. If you haven't signed in yet, get to the boot camp. We still got some time. We want you there. We're excited. We're ready. Failure creates success. Give it a shot. We want to see you there. This is Coach Manny saying, as I always do, as my friend Burl, Burl Walk tells me, we're out there to create a better world. Let's do it.